you know, taking a look outside right now. I mean, this this scene would look really nice if there was some sunshine out there. <laughs> it looks nice now, right? If you like the rain in the clouds, but. How long is this going to stick around here, Lisa? All day, Brian. <laughs> All day. And that being said, <laughs> goodbye. No, I'm <just> kidding. <laughs> so we are getting ready for, of course, the overcast skies, the rain, the big changes, because we have two frontal systems moving through our area. One, a warm front, which will keep us wet this morning, and then a cold front pushes through this afternoon, which will give us some heavier downpours, but we will see some breaks taking place, but not until late in the day. Currently 54 degrees outside of Seattle, 4 degrees warmer right now than it was this time yesterday, which is nice, but there's that frontal system, like I mentioned, giving us that widespread rain. Heavy downpours are picking up here and there, mainly along parts of the coast. You can see them in the brighter colors, right? That will continue to be embedded in that light, steady action we're expecting, like I said, throughout the day. So zooming in across parts of the foothills, definitely seeing some of those downpours lowering those visibilities. Bonnie Lake all the way just outside of Enumclaw Federal Way, Fife over to Des Moines, kind of on and off for you when it comes to at least the heavier action. Pretty steady when it comes to the rain in general. Fast warning by 12 o'clock, widespread. So this is going to continue for the afternoon hours. And then by 5 o'clock, you can see it becoming a little more scattered. Heavy downpours working their way up towards the northeast. Something very interesting. We will probably see some sun breaks later on this evening between 6, 8 o'clock. Even later on this evening, maybe some isolated moon breaks, but overall, pretty cloudy, so it is going to be tough to check out that full moon that Brian mentioned earlier. Blood moon, if you will. Fast warning when it comes to the accumulation. I've already seen over a tenth of an inch for a lot of us just this morning. Tack on an additional quarter of an inch to a half an inch of rain in total, up to potentially three quarters of an inch of rain. Now, those temperatures, they are going to peak in the lower 60s for most of us, but the majority of the day will be spent in the 50s here all across western Washington. And then I'll leave you with a look at your seven day forecast, give you some time to absorb. Of course, today, 62 degrees. We've got the rain in place, and then on Monday to at least kickstart. The work week mild start 50 degrees, but Monday afternoon 60 degrees. The clouds start to break. We start to clear out more sunshine back in the mix, which will be nice in some dry conditions on Tuesday as well. So that's pretty much the pattern. What we can expect another frontal system moves through on Wednesday, but that is a look at your seven day forecast. We'll be right back after this.